So we're going to do student checkup PowerPoint 2-2. Uh, I have my student checkup PowerPoint 2-1 open here. I'm going to go ahead and save it as student power, uh, checkup PowerPoint 2-2 and get started on things. All right, here we go. So I have my rename document here. And what I'm going to do with this real quick is I'm going to do a spell check up front, right? And then we're going to make a couple of comments on the slides uh, as we're working on this as, as a project, let's say that you're doing in class. You're going to make some comments on slides so you can uh, know where you left off possibly and what you need to work on. Then I'm going to go ahead and um, set some of the view options. Uh, which changes the view of the tabs and how we look at the at the slides. So let's go ahead and do spell check. So on this one, this is on the review tab here. I'm going to go ahead and hit spelling. It's going to run through anything. If you happen to misspell any words, it'll pick it up. Uh, I didn't, so it's going to go ahead and tell me that spell check is complete and I'm good to go. Now I can move on to the next thing that I'm doing here. So I'm going to go to slide two right here and I'm going to actually add a comment. So what I need to do is, on this one, is I need to list other recreational activities on this slide. So the comments is right here in the review tab, it's right in the center. And so I'm, I'm, wherever my cursor is, it's gonna add the comment. So I'm, I'm down here in the body, I can go ahead and click new comment, and you see right there, there's my comment right here that shows up. And then I can go ahead and type in, so list other recreational activities there. Okay, so that's going to go ahead and it's going to be a comment there. Now I can go ahead and go to my slide three. I'm going to put a comment there. If I click back to slide two, uh, there's my comment. It's there. List other recreational activities is a comment on that one. So anyway, so we're going on to slide three. I'm going to do the same thing. It's going to be in my body here. I'm going to go ahead and put another comment there. That is going to be get more information on the dam. So that is the comment there. So I need to get more information on, on the dams here. And uh, so those comments will help guide me in what I'm doing uh, as I continue to work on this project. So we're going to go now to the view tab and we're going to select ruler, guidelines, and guides. So this is really going to help me when I position any objects in my slides. It's going to help me make sure they're centered up and spaced correctly on the slide. So that'll help out. I'm also going to do, uh, I'm going to split set things to slide sorter. That's the view that I'm going to have here. So I see that it, there's all my slides. And as I have this display up, what I need to do is something that we did way back at the very first uh, week or two of the course with our first project, and that is to take a snip of this. So uh, I have my snipping tool here already on my taskbar ready to go. If you don't have it there, and you need to go and search right here for, uh, you can type in snip um, and bring up your snipping tool there and open it from your uh, search bar, Windows search bar as well. Okay, so here's snip. So what this does is it brings up and it gives me the opportunity to look at that view. So I'm just gonna take a quick snip of this view like this of all my slides. I'm going to hit this copy button here so it'll put that on my clipboard so I can paste it back in and I'll show you where to paste it. Okay, so we're going to go here. Uh, we're going to go to, we're going to enter a new slide here at the very end. So I'm going to go back to, to home here and I'm going to click on new slide. I'm going to go back to my view here so I can see kind of the, the normal view and I can work on this slide here. The title of the slide is going to be slide sorter snip and here in the body I'm going to go ahead and uh, do control V or paste and it'll uh, put in that view that I just took a snip of and I'm going to go ahead and go since I'm on the view tab again I'm going to go to ahead, go ahead and go to uh, zoom and fit so it's on fit already there so it looks good and then uh, after you do that, go ahead and save the presentation. So I'm going to click save here and uh, submit your student checkup PowerPoint 2-2 up to Canvas for grading. Uh, I hope this helps and we'll talk to you later. Have a good day.